imagine a doctor and an injury soccer player without an x-ray set? Or a hospital without an operating room? Do you like images of babies in the womb through third dimension pictures? Or what about the 3D printers, which can reproduce and as fine prototype to design a prosthesis? All materials and resources that helps in the doctor's job, from the most basic stethoscope to the most sophisticated ultrasound, said were made to aid in diagnosis and treatment of humans when we face illness. The development of said technologies has always relied on an engineer, but not any engineer, wanting to know about the needs of both patient and doctor, and capable through creativity and ingenuity of creating tech that facilities not only the expert's job, but elevating the quality of life of those facing treatment or finding the right diagnosis. These people are biomedical engineers, and their field of work is known as health engineering. Engineering is a set of knowledge, abilities, and scientific techniques applied to the development of technologies, an activity that transforms knowledge into something practical. And medicine as we know it now, it wouldn't exist without the support of technological sets capable of monitoring physiological functions and aid in illness diagnosis. It is in this point where patient's health and the well-being is in risk, where medicine and engineering converge. It may seem as something recent, but biomedical engineering has very remote origins. There are ancient processes remaining in Egyptian tombs date to be 3,000 plus years old. In addition, some suggest the anatomical drawings of Leonardo da Vinci where arm lever images are shown were projects that had more to do with engineering than medicine. It is known that during the late 19th century, the curious discovered radio, Rodgen X-rays. W. A. Thoven used the electrocardiograph for the first time, which he later perfect developed in Winop Galois in 91. And in 1924, Berger applied the record of electrocardiographical science on humans. But it was until 1930 that the term biomedical engineering was first coined, and schools for the development of this science were not created until 1960s. Biomedical engineering is dedicated to designing and building medical equipment, processes and therapy on the diagnosis devices. It also has to do with management and administration of technical resources linked to the hospital systems. For engineering health has been one of the main foundation of its supply research, with the design of used technologies capable of controlling variables that have the impact on the human health. A clear example is water purification, air quality monitoring, soil studies and endless tool, information and data to help the patient. This engineering speciality incorporates other disciplines, like telemedicine, which through telecommunication, electronics, and informatics facilitates the solving of problems in biology and medicine from afar. Biomedical engineering centers on the humankind and its health, diversifies in some specialities like clinical engineering, which focuses on the patient, hospital engineering, which develops infrastructure and support, electromedicine in charge of electrical equipment and biotechnology, associated with the genetics, agricultural applications and medication. Every time the doctor takes the stethoscope and put it on our chest to listen to our hearts, never forget that besides the doctor taking care of you, lies the work of an engineer who bet their knowledge on improving your health. Follow the heartbeat of this and all our stories. Discover, share and comment. All with Vitamina C.